a similar group of Warriors that took the floor to get a win against Houston on Friday night. And as Steve Kerr told us pregame, it's not your old Warriors, and it's certainly not what they hope will be the future Warriors, Richard, uh, down the stretch when all those guys return. It is the way Minnesota would love to start. Jaden McDaniels showing off his perimeter defensive skills. Here's Clay Thompson. Looney tried to tip it up and in no good, and a reach-in foul on Clay. Without Carl Anthony Towns, again without Rudy Gobert tonight. Well, and they, so he talked about wanting to see Conley be more aggressive. Yeah. In his... Without Carl Anthony Towns, again without Rudy Gobert tonight. Well, and they, so he talked about wanting to see Conley be more aggressive. Yeah. In his... Conley be more aggressive. Yeah. In his... Hey, coach, did you watch him in? Did you watch him in Memphis? Did you watch him in Utah? That's something that every team has always asked him to be more aggressive. But there, with the pass to Nas Reed. Reed will try for three. Not as long as my wrist and my feet still work, I'll be I'll forever be able to shoot the rock. Guys. <laughs> wow, my boy Chris DeMarco has come a long way. He's getting shouted out on ESPN <laughs> broadcast. <laughs> so shout out my guy. Yeah, shout out my guy Chris. Yeah, yeah. I used to bust his tail one-on-one -on -one when I was here, here 10 years ago. Addition to another position defensively is only going to make his career even longer and more successful. Thompson a shake of the head after that miss. Thompson a shake of the head after that miss. Edwards out to Reed. He'll try again from downtown and knock it down. When Nas Reed can stretch the ball, stretch the floor, he can shoot the ball, so he gives a different element for, uh, for spacing. Boy, it's already a different energy early in this ballgame for Minnesota. A little bit of a lackluster performance the other night in a loss to Charlotte. He can shoot the ball, so he gives a different element for, uh, for spacing. Boy, it's already a different energy early in this ballgame for Minnesota. A little bit of a lackluster performance the other night in a loss to Charlotte. Just a rock for Golden State in their lineup. And what has developed into one of the better rebounders this year. McDaniels for three, good. And right now, what you're going to do, obviously, this good ball movement there by the Timberwolves, but for both teams, watch teams that make you take shots that you don't. Stock. Yeah, so it, it just, it's a little different now when you're talking about the words, but again, to the earlier point, you know, Rick Nas Reed has just had an outstanding start to this game. In a month and a month and a half is very, very different. Same with this team in the Minnesota Timberwolves. There is really no Carl Anthony Towns. There's no timetable for him to come back, which means it's not a week away. And he starts out 0 for 2 from downtown. Edwards off the bounce, the elevation, the stick back up and in, and Nas Reed is having himself a first quarter. And he starts out 0 for 2 from downtown. Edwards off the bounce, the elevation, the stick back up and in, and Nas Reed is having himself a first quarter. Has never scored this many points in a first quarter before. He's got a dozen. Here he is. Using that newfound handle of his, and he ends up walking with it. They're booing now. He's laughing. Uh, Ten-year veteran. Reed for three. Nas Reed, another triple. Twelve of them away from home. Nine games till almost half their slate is against the East, where you can't pick up those head-to-head -head wins against your competitors in the West. And that has helped Golden State get back into it. Nas Reed with a touch. Oh, my goodness. He has an advantage over everybody except maybe Kaminga and Looney out there. Yeah, he loves playing Golden State. Has had a couple of nice games against them this year. Here's Reed. Goes to the left hand. No, Baldwin snags it. He has an advantage over everybody except maybe Kaminga and Looney out there. Yeah, he loves playing Golden State. Has had a couple of nice games against them this year. Here's Reed. Goes to the left hand. No, Baldwin snags it. Minus three starters tonight. They have 55 points sitting over on that sideline. Kindly knocks down the three. But you need your best player to get going. We're six minutes left to go here in this first half, and he doesn't have a bucket yet. Boy, a lot of deflections, a lot of turnovers. And at both ends of the floor, Reed 
direct line drive to the rim, and Nas Reed with 20. Tried for two in a row. Conley, Alexander Walker, and Jordan there defensively. Reed will try for another triple. Tried for two in a row. Conley, Alexander Walker, and Jordan there defensively. Reed will try for another triple. Vincenzo. And the patient whistle foul going to be called here on Reed. Five for 16 from deep for Golden State. And Reed, the recipient of the drive and dish. He's going back, giving his entire bench in the ear fill, or ear full right now. You know, dealing with the injury to Carl Anthony Towns all year long, but then the trade, D'Angelo Russell goes away, and all of a sudden, a guy averaging 35 a night. Now he's starting to look at, uh, might need 30, 32, 34 a night. Winner of this one gets above 500 for the season. The loser drops below. Nas Reed, another triple for Nas. 25 points. Go up exponentially. At the start of the day, he had nine teams in the West that were four and a half games away from a four seed. So nine teams in the West that were four and a half games away from a four seed. So you'd be able to host first round action. And what should prove to be a Wild West finish, Conley. Reed. Off the bounce and to the rim. Minnesota, all five guys on the floor scored. They hit six of their first seven shots. Reed and one, and Nas Reed has a free throw coming for a brand spanking new career high of 30 points. They weren't closing out to him at three. He could take his time and shoot threes, which he did. Then when Looney decides to close out to him, he has the ability to drive. Anthony Edwards, three for ten, seven points tonight. Reed. Heat check. No Carl Anthony Towns, no Rudy Gobert, and now he just steps up. Let's see if he's right on time. Gosh, he must have. Poole behind Looney. Normal Warriors team that we have seen in the Steve Kerr area. Like I said, third best record in the West at home. Second chance points there, and you got to play a clean game. That means knocking down your free throws when you have an opportunity. That is one thing in which you would look at the Minnesota Timberwolves and say, hey, cut out the turnovers. That is the ultimate thing that you want to see from a young player. You don't want him sulking, frustrated that he's not getting shots or calls or fouls. The fact that he is out there supporting his teammates. I think they're going back to that zone that was so effective at, at kind of keeping Anthony Edwards where, you know, he is right now. Kaminga, his pass picked off. Conley. Reed in the trail for three. Oh. Maybe two or three the other way for Minnesota. But again, they're guarding Anthony Edwards. They're making them play four, four on four. Yep. Anderson to inbound. Nasri for three. 